Okay. Here we are, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, neophytes of all ages. My name's Alan, aka Neocryptor, and welcome to Frozen Flame. This is a ooh, look at me. I'm a I'm a skelly bob. Yeah, <laughs> this is a a sandbox RPG game that just hit early access on Steam. I, I I'm excited. I love this art style, and uh, the fact that it's like RPG driven, you know, is is just really cool to me. Um, there is a lot for them to do still, but the roadmap looks solid, and the game itself already looks pretty cool. So I figure we'll dive in and check it out a little bit. By the way, guys, this video is sponsored by G Portal. Uh, if you, uh, you know, they're my server company of hosts, and I want to thank them, our server company of choice. <laughs> I want to thank them for sponsoring this video. We're going to touch on uh, what they offer more here in a minute, but I want to get through this little starting area. I vlogged in long enough to like set up my hotkeys and uh, make sure everything is running right. So let's go ahead and jump in here and uh, yeah, do a few things. Oh, look, we got a sword from a mysterious lady. Let's get the mysterious sword from the mysterious lady and continue on because there's more skelly bobs here. And I don't think that there are cousins or anything. I mean, they might be our cousins. There's several cousins I've had that, you know, I, I would like to hit with a sword. So uh, yeah, let's, you know, let's, uh, let's omit that. Let's omit that. <laughs> but all right, so the combat is, is okay. It uh, feels a little sluggish, but overall it's not bad. I mean, we're cleaving through, you know, multiple enemies at the same time so that's something we have a dodge key the dodge key is not bound by default to anything just to let you know that's one of the keys i did have to bind myself i think we can double tap or i don't know i don't know what the, how you're supposed to dodge honestly um normally but i set it to my left alt so i can you know hit dodge because i do play conan exiles and i'm kind of used to that being a dodge key so all right lady Shall we jump through the mystic toilet bowl? Yeah, there we go. Mithra, head straight for the energy vortex. Okay, bye. As she gets attacked by more skelly bobs. All right, and now this is where we make our character. So let's go ahead and make some cool looking dude here, right? Uh, uh, let's go with a little... Eh, eh. Yeah, we'll get, we'll have a tan. Let's have a tan. Let's go into our face details. Oh, oh, we got a blind eye. I like it. Let's do that. Let's give our good eye. Uh, let's make his eyes green. There's not a too terribly much uh, customization for your character as far as character creation goes. Let's go ahead and do the you know some white hair. Blah 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 blah. Yes, hairstyle. Uh, ooh, uh huh. Yeah. Mm hmm. I see that. Mm hmm. No. No. Uh, yay. There we go. There we go. Let's do that. Tattoo color. Let's go ahead and make that on more on brand with the purple side. Let's look at our tattoo options here. We're on number seven, which is not bad. That's a little back tattoo thing going on. Okay. We got, we got something that the, you know, the, uh, the rock would have right there, or maybe Jason Momoa. Uh, oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah. That's kind of cool. I kind of dig that. I like that too. What we got? Oh, a dragon. The purple dragon wanders the wilderness. Okay, you know what? Let's go with. Let's go with the dragon. Or no, let's go with that. Let's go with that. I, I dig it. Okay. And we're going to hit E and we're going to start our journey in the Temple of the Flame, apparently. So, looks like we go this way. Let's talk to old dude here wearing, I don't know, a bird head. That's a big bird head. I see you got meat on your bones, little one. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. What? You don't remember anything? Do you have a headache? No biggie, it happens to everyone. Just keep going down the path. We'll meet you on the other side. Yeah, yeah, I don't know about that guy. He sounds weird. <laughs> by the way, we are playing on a server. Um, again, hosted by G Portal. It's part of one of my community servers. So if you're a uh, if you're a community supporter and you would like to join in, 
details are on my Discord. And if you're not a supporter and you would still like to play, just shoot me a message, man. I'll, I'll hook you up. I know what it's like to be broke. I'm always broke. But, you know, just saying there's options starting at 99 cents. Either whether you're on membership or YouTube membership or Patreon. Either way, it's all Gucci. All right. Let's, uh, let's jump in here. Actually, and before we get started, let's go ahead and talk about our lovely sponsor today, G Portal. All right, guys, let's just take a moment and talk about G Portal. They're my favorite, you know, the favoritest server host I've ever been with. They are amazing guys. I talk about them all the time. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to share a little bit with you after all they did sponsor this video. So yeah, they've been around for many, 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 many years uh, about they have like 20 years experience of hosting, which is amazing. If you ask me, they started out in the European market, moved over to the North American market, which is when I uh, hooked up with them, uh, which is, I don't know, five years ago at this point. It, it's been a long it's been a while. It's been a long time and I've never had any problems with their servers. Their support is top notch. A few times I've needed to contact support, which doesn't happen very often. And it's not just because I'm a content creator, it's because these guys know what they're doing they are gamers the whole company started with you know a couple of friends that wanted to be able to play online together and so you know they they understand they understand what you know a game server should run like how support should be uh how you know it, it's just they have their philosophy is the right philosophy when it comes to setting up a game server company in my opinion and uh, yeah i have nothing but good things to say i mean as you can see here immediately online which is true you get your you rent your you select how many slots you want for a server then you select the server you the game you want at, and uh, you know it's instantly a boom just like that uh server management the back end is phenomenal 24 7 support you know the all the spiel that every game server host says but i can tell you these guys deliver these guys deliver and i won't pimp them out just because you know they're paying me to say this this is my honest opinion uh, i won't recommend something if i don't like it myself and i like i said i've been with these guys for you know five ish years now and it is so simple all you gotta do if you want to rent a server is you know you can you make your account you can click order now let's go with top seller frozen flame right you select how many slots you want you know boom 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 up to a thousand which uh, frozen flame doesn't support that it supports up to i believe 24 right now um yeah something like that you pay the money and it gets added to your game cloud so let's go over to my servers real quick boom as you can see here or and you know when you're done with the server let's say the seven days to die server right yeah i have 10 slots dedicated to that i can just delete it simple as that and now those slots are back in my pool of slots i can use so if i wanted to say set up a second frozen flame server all i'd have to do is scroll through the list here find frozen flame uh i think i can even search really yeah yeah look at that right there frozen flame boom i select how many slots i want to do let's say let's do 15. let's go ahead and add that sucker in there your order is complete and we'll redirect you now we're back on my game cloud this is the new server we just set up so we can click in here we can go into the basic settings this we're not going over settings but you know you can go through adjust things as you see and just click simple as that and the server is starting and it is up it is literally that fast guys i highly recommend if you're looking for a game server check out g portal use my link down in the description it'll save you 10 percent off of you know all the servers that they offer and it helps support the channel all right let's get back to the game right so here we are we are have just emerged from the awesome toilet bowl of swirly portalness <laughs> so let's go ahead and get a move on shall we guys i really like the lighting in this game it's really good oh what's this what are we Cradle of the Keeper's Memorial. We, the pilgrims, were plucked from the arms of death by magical flame of the Keeper and swear to fight the cursed ones until our bodies are ash and our souls are extinguished. Ooh. I wonder, yeah, that must be what we are. We, we must be here to fight the cursed ones. Whoa, hello. Oh, it's fast travel. Check that out. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we need to unlock other fast travel points, maybe? 
Let's go ahead and continue on. Look at the glowy white birds. They're so glowy. Oh. Oh. Yeah, this place looks pretty, pretty awesome. Okay. Let's move on. By the way, guys, if you're enjoying the content, make sure you leave a like because, you know, YouTube likes all that crap. I usually don't pimp out the YouTube stuff, but, you know, you know, we, we got to grow. We got to grow, guys. We're, we're like 50 or 6,500 strong and growing. That feels like one of those old 80s commercials for vitamins. <laughs> now that I say that out loud. Oh, harvest. Let's go ahead and harvest. Boom. Okay, we got some stuffs. Let's just grab a few stuffs. Is this glowy? Oh, I see glowy stuff. Okay, branches. Cool. What's this? Examine. The trunk of this tree is too thick. The axe can't cut it. I don't have an axe yet. We we haven't done that thing yet. Can we craft an axe? Let's inventory. Craft. Oh, look at that. We can. Let's go ahead and get ourselves an axe because we're going to probably need that. Right? All right. So we got that. What is this? Oh, campfire. Straw bedding. Garden bed. Workbench. Sweet. Okay. All right. Moving along. We have an axe. Oh, hello. What? Oh, gosh. What are you? Why are you? Are you? Ah. Okay. I guess we'll ask him a question. All right. Well, that took care of that problem. Oh, come for us. Grief, catastrophe, madness, hopelessness. Okay. I've been robbed. I've been cleaned out of everything. They stole my most precious possessions. The local cursed ones are taking everything that isn't nailed down. They only look them with it. But if you're not careful, that's it. You'll be standing there naked without your skivvies. Well, that's a problem. Oh, ho, ho. I beg your pardon. Maybe you'll be able to help me. What do you think? Just clear out the curse camp. These bastards stole my backpack. Get it. It's dear to my heart. Just don't fight them unarmed. Instead, make yourself a stone axe. Ah, we're on top of it. For materials at hand. Yeah, okay. We got that. All right. So that must be where we need to go. Oh, uh, yeah. On the compass at the top, you can see a little question mark thingy. So let's um head over that way. Ooh, what's this? It's a thing. Whoa! Okay, that looks like a skill tree. We'll come back. Okay. Yo! Ellie! Ellie, stop shooting stuff at me. I do not appreciate it. Woo! Okay. All right. Well, maybe we're going to, like, smash flower petals for a second here. Because they seem to be angry flower petals. A little laggy. I think it's my OBS. Guys, I'm, I'm getting ready to reinstall my OS. I went, I was on Linux for quite a while. I came back to Windows a few months ago and oh, I regret it. I'm going back to Linux. I am 100% going back to Linux. Probably actually after this video goes live, I'll be well on my way of redoing my system. So yeah. Sorry about the frame lags. That will be taken care of soon.pm. Okay. All right, let's continue on this way. I really don't know. I I even have DLSS on. So I don't know what is up with that. Okay, that looks like a chest. Are you going to shoot me from... Yeah, okay, so we got to take care of him. A little smackety, hackety, packety. And bazap. You gone. You out of here. Oh, good grief. Another one. They just keep gobbing. Uh, okay, can we check this out now? Man, we are like almost half health. That's no bueno. Oh, hi. Uh, yeah, let's, um, oh, I smashed a box. Yeah, like I said, the, the combat feels a little sluggish. It doesn't feel bad. Just a little bit on the sluggish side. Oh, we leveled up and that refilled our life. That is good. Standard RPG stuff right there. And I am not complaining. Ooh, apples, can we? Is there stuff in these crates? Oh, there is. Look at that. We get loots from smashing things. 
Very does Zelda-esque. Like I said, people compare this to like Breath of the Wild, but I've never played it. Oh, did I see some purple lightning or something up there? I think I did. Branches. You have loot? You, you I think it, Oh, look, you have loot. Give me loot. Where's the other guy we murderized? I don't know. Oh, collect. Got it. Got some apples. Apples to oranges. All right, let's go. I That was the guy because we got the backpack in that loot. So let's go ahead and head back to the dude. Turn in our stuff. Fight, fight some more pedals, maybe? I, I don't know. <laughs> and we just cut through here without you guys going ham. No, you're going to go ham. Let's see if they'll follow us. Boom! We got some coin and some essence and another quest. My backpack, you have it. I hope the vermin who stole it suffered organizing pain. You have a spark of talent, no doubt about it. As a reward, I offer you the chance to purchase something from me. Or I could ask you something else. Those cursed made off with all my food supplies. I've been gotten pretty hungry here. Do you hear my stomach rumbling? I wouldn't say no to a fruit dessert right now. A dessert that you'll make for me. <laughs> Remember, all food is made over campfire. To make one, collect branches and chop wood. The fruit dessert is made for fruits or berries. That apple will be enough. Just don't go over where two apples will make a fruitcake, which I can't stand. I mean, nobody likes fruitcake, right? Okay. So, you know what? Give me a second, guys. I gotta see if I can clear up this lag. I don't know what's causing this, is but it is this driving me cray cray at the moment. I gotta fix it. Yeah, okay, that's better. I don't know what that was about. I, it wasn't OBS. Dude, I had to restart the game, and then yeah, everything seems to be Gucci again. All right, so we need to craft a campfire. Do we have the stuff? What are we missing? Uh, we need some rocks, man. We gotta look around for some rocks here. That's branches, but we'll take it anyway. It's very dark. He's, oh, I think I see rock. I do see rock. Let's get rock. And let's chop tree. Because we need, you know, I'm sure we need branches and wood for stuff anyway. So let's grab all the stuff. There we go. Uh, I don't want to go over to the purple, the purple flowers of blasting. So let's just kind of explore around a little bit. Do a uh, purple flower of blasting. Ow! Stupid purple flower, black, more pink. It, was, it really looks more pink. But let's go ahead and just kind of ignore him for a minute. Hey, look at chest. What we got? Health potion. That's probably useful. Let's jump back here. Oh, look, rock. Rock and roll, my man. Rock and roll. What is, am I cold? Oh, I'm cold. Look at that. So we have like some temperature stuff going on on the left hand side of the screen. Handy to know. We are very cold. You can hear the creaking. That's wood. That's rock. Rock and roll, man. Rock and roll. You know, it's weird. This game doesn't seem to have a lot of settings as far as like in its, uh, you know, on the server settings, you can't adjust gather rates or anything really. It's kind of weird. I wonder if that is something that they're going to be adding later on. Cause I really, I just can't see a, survival game even if it is mostly a, a, an rpg mix with the survival game i just can't see that um without being able to adjust those settings it feels like those are kind of key things you know gather rate xp etc 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 can we make the thing now because I, I think i'm freezing to death yes we can do it right there can we let's oh how, how wait how do i add wood I hit E. Oh, I hold. Okay. Okay. We got we got some wood going on. Oh, we're warming up, which is good. Okay, so he wants a pie, which is cooked with one of those. Okay. So we have to discover food recipes. I dig that. That's cool. He said if we did two of them, it would make something else. I think we need a snack because our health is really low, so... Let's try combining a couple apples. Boom! 
Boom, what do we get? A fruitcake. Yeah. Now let's saute some mushrooms, maybe? I don't know. What, what will two mushrooms make? We have a cookbook. Okay, so, all right. As we discover recipes, it gets added to our cookbook. Cool. Groovy, man. I dig it. I dig it. And... Vinny, what do we get? Mushroom kebab. Okay. Why if we just cook one? I have a feeling I'm going to spend a lot of time cooking. I, I need to rename my Steam account so this character shows up as Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> oh, can we? No? Okay, so we're level two. Oh, you know what? I bet we have to go to that level up shrine. Roasted mushrooms. Oh, uh -huh. hard time stopping. Stamina five, health gain 25. Okay. Cool. Let's uh just, yeah, get out of there for now. Let's go ahead and eat the fruitcake, I think. 50 health. Health restoration too. What? Nom? Oh gosh! Really? Come on, man. I'm enjoying a nice snack and you gotta be all up in my business while I'm doing my eating. That's just rude. That is just rude. But at least we're at full health. I think I want to stick around in this fire for a little bit because it's apparently really freaking cold. Let's see here. Okay. Ah, my dessert. I thought I'd never have my get my lunch today while I'm eating. You can help me with something else. What do you do? What? What? You're not going to do a favor for your new friend? Uh, okay. The backpack the curse stole for me had a hole in it. Apparently, all the flint that I so carefully collected from this area fell through that hole. Don't think I'm trying to accuse you of anything. I'm just stating the fact that I am not left with no flint. This is the chance for you to help me out. You find out how to mine flint for when you need it to. You can't mine flint with your bare hands. You need a pickaxe. He's made a workbench. The workbench isn't easy to make either. You can't place one on bare ground. First, you need build foundation. As soon as you make yourself stone pickaxe, start research. Or start your search for flint deposits. A few strikes and you'll have the stone you seek. Everything clear? If you forget something, just ask. Now it's time for me to start devouring this dessert. <laughs> okay. So we need to build the foundation, which uh, building mode is Q. Let's add... Uh, oh, okay. Um, let's do that. And then we can go in and make a foundation or, or a... Uh, being a jigger my bob, right? Uh, what do we need? Oh, we're missing stuff. Uh, log. Ah, that we can do. We need to find three to chop down. Why am I talking like this? This is not that character talking. <laughs> Let's chop down this tree. We do seem to have a sprint attack, which is kind of nice. I like that. Oh, wait, that's right. It doesn't go into inventory. I got to pick it up. Boom, 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 boom. What's that over there? Stone. We'll probably need that for a stone pickaxe, I'm going to wager. Oh, and it's getting cold. Hey, there was a chest on the other side. Nope, nothing like that over here. Okay. Alright. So, let's see. Tab, craft, workbench. Give me a workbench. Alright. Uh, to save yourself from harsh cold weather, build buildings with walls and ceilings the shelter status effect oh okay so that works kind of like arc so we can do oh we got a bunch of stuff here what all we got no oh, we a bow we've got a wooden staff crude staff containing a bit of flame at least it's a magic spell when used oh i do like me some magic not gonna lie let's go ahead and make this first though uh, ooh, we can make, a uh, cloth gloves. Yeah, let's do that. And let's go ahead and make this, because having a dedicated weapon might not be a bad idea, right? So, let's rearrange our bar a little bit. Do that. Uh-oh. Where'd it go? How about... Okay. And then... Nope. <laughs> put you on one. Let's put you on three... And where'd my axe go? 
four sounds good for you. Let's put some food of some sort in the middle there. All right. So we need to find flint, but let's look at this. Oh, okay, so that doesn't do anything. What about if that guy can block? Fireball. Oh, Logan. Okay, cool. All right. I think we need to level up. Um, man, I don't like doing these at night. <coughs> Excuse me. So I think we're going to look at that level up shrine. All right. Well, that works well. And then I think I'm going to wait for nighttime to pass. God, there's so many of these things. So many. We feel so slow. Oh my goodness. Come on. It looks like Don's coming up, so I think we're going to hit the shrine. We're going to let Don come so we can have a better view of what we're doing. And uh, then we'll continue on a little bit. So far, I'm enjoying the game. Okay, so Heroes Ancestry gives you the ability to use combat energy. Okay. Combat or fighting enemies will fill up your power bar hold. Oh, I see. Okay. Cool. Do we have any more of those? Nope. Frozen flames here. Oh, and you're attacking us. Quit that. Stop that. I don't like you. I mean, I'm all about saving the environment, but in your case, I will make an exception. All right. I'm going to run over here and wait for daytime uh, to pop up. And then we'll continue our way. It's getting light now, so it shouldn't be too terribly long. I would not assume anyway. Oh, come on. You're right by my cozy campfire. Okay, the sun is up. We can see a little better. I'm warm. Now we need to go looking for pen er, pimp. <laughs> we need to go. Hey, those guys are blue now. Hello, blue guy. Are you going to... You, you don't care about me. What? Okay, so apparently these guys at nighttime are aggressive and in the daylight, they could give a care less, which is cool, man. I'm good with that. All right, so we need to find Flint. I don't know about you, but if I was looking for nodes to mine with a pickaxe, I would go into a rocky place. Yes, yes, look at that. Let's switch to our pickaxe. And go smickety smack. Don't hit back. Oh, look at that. We got some stone. We got three flint. Oh, and that was enough. But, you know, we're not stopping there because flint's probably used for something useful. Let's go ahead and go ahead and smickety smack some more. Can we hold the mouse button down? We can. Okay, I don't have to continuously click. That's awesome sauce right there. Good. More flint. That's probably, I just want to have a little extra, you know, a little, just in case there's something we can craft with it ourselves. Let's head back over here, turn in our stuffs, see what he has to offer us now. Yeah, that's weird. This guy's just don't care about us anymore. I'm, I'm not complaining. Oh, we got, uh, uh, okay. We got a bunch of stuff there. That's awesome. Uh, for now, I work on repairing my cracked horns, or else why do I even need the flint? Eh. One more thing. It seems that your path leads to portal as well. Bonehead wanted to see you. That rascal is waiting for you at the, from your destiny, not far from your destination. He wants, what he wants with you is none of my business. Okay. So let's see, what do you trade, my man? Okay, so you have cloth bandana blueprint. Torch blueprint. 120 for a torch blueprint? Are you kidding me? Wow. Okay. <laughs> 120 for a torch. You seem... Unless money is easier to get, you are very overpriced, my dude. 
Oh, very overpriced. Okay. So what can we can we craft anything with the stuff we picked up? Oh, we could do a great sword. Um I like I, I think I'm gonna stick with the staff. Not gonna lie. Kind of a magic person. Primitive grudgel studs fakes at one end. Okay, well, we're just gonna leave this stuff here and I guess uh tootle on. Do some exploring and let's have a singity snack real quick. Oh, we're getting bonus health. Look at that. Look at that. Hey, what? You know what? I don't think we looked at this thing. What is this thing? Huh. We have an activate. Let's activate the thing and see what happens. Collect energy. Oh, okay. That's lit up. Grab that. Oh, I see another one over there. Oh, these guys are hostile again. Oh, no. Not so cool, man. You know what? We're just ignoring them. Because they're like the stormtroopers of this game. They can't hit the broadside of a bantha. Whee! Diggity dodge. Zig, zag, zig, zag. Two, there was three. Boom, we got it. What do we get? Ooh, okay, we leveled up. That's awesome. All right. Can, am I going to actually have to murder you guys? I, oh, man. Okay. Let's murder. Murder the bad flowers of doom. Keep an eye on our health here. I mean, this is a good old strafe seems to do the job. Man, there are so many of them. Seems to be splash damage with the staff. I'm kind of digging it. Oh, man, we got in another level. Okay, you know what? You guys, you guys are all right in my book. You help me gain XPs, so. Is that it? Are we good? Any more? Oh, yeah, Jackie. Okay. Are you going to attack me? Or are you are kosher? Are we good, man? Okay, we good. All right. Okay, so we got two points to spend. Awesome sauce. Uh... What's that do? Extra health. That's never a bad thing. Touch of energy. Increase the accumulation of combat energy. Let's do that. A staff? Ooh. Oh, that would be great. But we need three flames for that. Um. Go more health for now. What's this one do? Okay, that's sword and great sword. Momentum energy. I got my physical pack results in... Mmm, okay. Slows down the destruction of all weapons. That's handy. From killing enemies leads to increased combat energy. Okay. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool. All right, wow, look at our health bar. It's like going places. Where do we need... We need to go over there. Okay, let's go that way. Let's do some exploration. Oh, a glowy thing. I see a glowy thing. Let's go check out the glowy thing. Hey, is this stuff destroyable? Maybe not. I need to figure out how to repair. I hear something. Oh, hi. Hi there, guy. So the melee combat with the axe felt sluggish. This feels okay. The combat with the staff feels okay. Oh, what we got? <gasps> okay, we got some leaves and indescript fruit. Okay, we go with that. Some pine berries. Saw a stone thingy. I wanted to look at the stone. Oh, hi! Blech. Nice. You got some gold. Cool. All right. What's this one say? The cursed ones like a plague destroyed everything in their path. Even the land was distorted and destroyed by them. Okay. Good to know. Let's grab some apples because food is good. It is how we heal. Hey, there's thorns or something. 
I wonder if that's just deco. Nope. We, it looks like it's attackable. Yeah. Let's blow it up. There we go. What we got? We got a chest. Another health potion. Cool. Never a bad thing. What's this over here? So many things to check out in a new world, in a new game. Oh, hi. I think I just saw a couple of your friends over there. All right. In your face with the flames. Ooh, we're getting hurt a little bit. Oh, I zigged when I should have zagged. There we go. And we got a chest, a big chest. 30 coins. Yeah, we got some coins, guys. Check that out. We are doing some good stuff here. All right, let's see. So we had a chest, we had stuff. All right, moving on, moving on. Meh, toward the light. Oh, maybe not. Maybe there's a thing here. Oh, there's a tablet of some form or fashion from the Notes Sorcerer Explorer. Congratulations, Pilgrim. You found my tablet with the translation of the Ku language. If a lizard keeps saying glavu, it means skewer with insects. Oh, okay. It has the No Man's Sky vibe to it. We're learning languages. Mushroom. It's mushrooms and some more apples. Cool. Oh, and more baddies. Hello, buddy. Uh-oh. We died. It. Uh, okay, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? Oh, we're back at the beginning and we didn't lose anything from our inventory. Sweet. That's kind of cool. But there goes the frames again. That's kind of strange, guys. I don't know what to make of that. do not know what to make of that. There's probably some kind of setting or it could be something to do with my OS, which I'm still, you know, bra, bra, bra about. All right, let's, uh, I guess, work our way back over there, but I'm going to do a quick restart on the game. So the frames are good. Again, if you guys got the game and you're having, you know, if, uh, let me know if you're having this issue too, because I tried it with and without OBS on and it didn't seem to make a difference. Is that how we emote? Slash E? Oh, look at that. Slash E. Hello? Oh, there we go. Ooba, ooba, uh, ooh, ja, ja, yeah. Ticka, ticka, dow. Yeah, I'm gonna restart. Okay, there we go. All right, let's go back to where we were. Yeah, that's so weird. I don't know what is causing that, but it seems like after a cutscene or apparently after I die, I get a bunch of jitters. And like I said, it could just be my OS install. We'll we'll know more here in the next day or two, because like I said, after I record finish recording this video, I am going to start reinstalling, uh, going back to Linux and getting everything set up. Oh, our staff is broke. Uh oh. Um, can I switch? There we go. That's about broke, too. I should have made another weapon. Actually, you know what? Let's finish this guy. Let's go back to where we have that stuff. See if we can figure out how to repair. Maybe just go ahead and check out the building mechanics a little bit. And I think I'm just going to end the video with that. Because, yeah, I, I really kind of ooh, fish oh i can catch fish by hand nice I'm, I'm down with that i am down with that 
Um, yeah, I really, I just, I need to start thinking about getting my OS reinstalled because I've just been having nothing but issues since the recent Windows updates and, you know, everything I want to do works on Linux, recording, playing my games, etc, 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 without any problems whatsoever. My only gripe is my file size when I, for videos, because uh, some codec support is not present under Linux. My file size for my videos tends to be a lot higher than it should be. Okay, how do we repair? Okay, can we, there, cause we got something. Do I just drag it on or something? I don't, E, okay. Oh, we used it. What do we use it on? Oh, it can be absorbed. That's, we're absorbing it. Okay, yep, I don't know how to repair. Can we draw? No, because this doesn't have an inventory. I mean, mm, I gotta figure that out, but we're gonna craft a new staff, and just so we have a backup of them, let's do a bow too. All right, let's check out the building mechanics just a little bit. This area looks fine, because we're not gonna build anything too huge, I would not say. Uh, so let's do that. Let's, can we rotate? We can. Uh, what we got? Yeah, so we can go boom, boom, boom. Do a three by three. Not enough resources. Okay, so we need to chop down a tree probably. Let's exit build mode, is that right? Okay. Ooh, I critted that tree. Did you see it? You didn't know what happened. Or three by two, actually. Let's do a three by two. Not enough resources. Okay, more tree chopping. I'm gonna chop some trees, guys. That's what I'm gonna do. How do we exit build mode? Right click. Okay. Ow! Ooh, ooh, I'm burning. I'm burning. That's not good. Ooh, hot stuff. All right, I'm gonna chop some trees and we'll check out the building a little bit. So far, I'm really enjoying the game. It's it's relaxing. It, I love the art style. Uh, this art style is, in my in my opinion, timeless. It ages well, whereas realistic art styles do not. Oh, we're over encumbered, man. Apparently, um, so you know, it, it's it's good. The lighting engine seems. I love the lighting. The lighting seems on point. I really really enjoying you know the way this game looks. If I just figure out those stutters which I'm sure I'll figure out and or one of you guys probably might know something because you guys are all geniuses. So you can let me know in the uh, down there. You know, this uh, encumbered walk is probably one of the best ones I've seen. <laughs> I know that's weird talking about that, but I mean, it really looks like this guy is struggling in Ark and Conan. You're just slowed down and it's not really a separate animation. But this, you're just, you're gritting your teeth, clenching your fists and just trying to get where you need to go. <sighs> yeah, I, it looks good, man. Um, walls, okay. Okay, we can make some walls. Not enough resources, of course. All right. So the building thus far seems pretty on point as far as the style of game goes. Uh, so, yeah, I think it's going to work out pretty good. Uh, eh, eh, no, no, I just I want I want more. <laughs> Give me more. Oh, can we make a box? Is that a thing that we can create? Like some kind of storage box? What's that? It's a makeshift door. All right, let's see. Can we make storage? We can't. Right there. Give me that. Look, that'll help a lot. All right, so let's drop some storage. Yeah, right click out of there. Let's get rid of some stuff in our inventory. Can we just double click it? We can. That's awesome sauce right there. Uh, You know, that's fine. Fine, let's go ahead and move. All the stuff we don't particularly need on us at the moment. I got a lot of cooking stuff to look at too. Oh, you know what? We didn't. Oh, it's already on the bar. That works. Never mind. 
All right, I'm going to do a quick little gathering run uh, and we will try and build a little house. Maybe cue a tea, tree chopping montage. Da 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 Except not that song. Well, you know, it seems kind of apropos that we might finish this off at nighttime since we started at nighttime. Let's go ahead and uh, do some walls, man. Oh, wait, they're not snapping? Do they not? That's interesting. That's an interesting decision right there. Can we do a window? How do we change to a window? Do we have windows? I don't see windows. Really don't. That's weird. Huh. That's fine, though. That's fine. We got, like, half walls. That's a thing we could do. Um, but let's do that. Let's do a door there, maybe? Can, how do we do a door? What's that? Makeshift shutters? Oh, okay. So that's like a window. Okay. Holy crap, man. That door is bloody huge. Bloody great tracks alone. Can we do a double door, though? Because, you know, that makes up for it. Boom. Double door. Look at that. I'm, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Oh, wait. No, I didn't want that. I want to go back in here. We want to hit Q again. It's going to take a minute for me to get used to this. So, like, you know, I don't know where that place. I just placed a wall out. Uh, off. Okay, so you don't need a foundation to snap walls to. That's an, an interesting choice, IMO. I mean, I'm not complaining because that could be very useful later on. And we can snap the walls down. Kind of like in Conan. Which will, you know protect our foundations not that i'm not that i know if we need to worry about such things okay let's try and get a little fancy here shall we that's a half wall right yeah look at that okay so we can put a half wall there not enough resources okay okay so back to the resource grind but so far ow ow Ooh. ah the burning the burning feels not pleasant um so far the building's not too shabby. And we can put in... Oh, and... Okay, so we got green and that's yellow. So there is some kind of structural support thing going on, too. I really appreciate that in games. So that's cool. All right, well, um, back to resource grinding, I guess. Oh, wait, how do I open the door? There we go. Luckily, things seem to respawn pretty quick. But we're going to get cold, so we can't spend too much time out here doing this. I'll, I know I left the resources. I got to get used to that, but that's fine. You know what would be cool is it's uh, having to continuously tap E, maybe hold E to pick up all the resources of the same type in the area. I don't think that would be a bad idea. I swear I've seen another game that does that. But I can't remember what game it is. I thought it was a pretty nice little feature. Okay, I don't want to deal with those guys. You know what? Let's run up here where we've spawned in, see if there's any trees that we could chop down. I mean, it's not like we're deforesting the area because they come back rather quickly. So, those trees are too big. Okay. So that's not going to work. All right. Well, hmm. I really don't have a lot more time to do stuff. This video is already pretty long. I do want to see if we can make a quick window of some, you know, form or shape. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe I got enough branches to do that. Uh. Okay, so other things to note, the doors don't auto-close, so that is also a thing. Cool. Good to know. All right, let's see what we can do here, because I want to do some fancy stuff. Hey, actually, will this add support if I add beams? Uh, no. No, it doesn't. Okay. That's good to know. Makeshift beam. Hey, look at that. Boom. We got ourselves that's actually brown 
and that beam is all green all the way up. I wonder what we need to do for that. But yeah, that's a that's a good little makeshift window right there. Uh, let's add a couple beams there. I want to try and figure out the support thing. Can we? so if we add if can we add a beam here? We can add one there and there. I had it. I had it. It wanted to snap. Come on. Give it back to me, man. Let's do it there. Okay, so that didn't add any support that I saw. Maybe... Oh, oh, come on. Come on, you know, you wanna. There we go. Okay, that's still no supporty. We don't have a beam going all the way up, apparently. All right, let's add a cross beam down here. Because, you know, that would be, in my mind, add support. That's still yellow. I don't know. I'm going to have to play around with these mechanics a little bit. But we made a makeshift window. This is all framed in. Very interesting. Maybe we need still yellow. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to play with this a bit off camera. See if I can figure out the stability mechanics on in this game. But guys, I think sadly that is really all I have time for today. Um yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do. And don't forget to check out G Portal. They are amazing. I am, yeah, I love those guys. Great deal. The great people. <laughs> uh, by the way, if you use my link and it doesn't say show my name at the top of the screen somewhere. Um, yeah, there's a use Neo Cryptor as your code at checkout. And because there's been YouTube's been doing weird things with the links lately. I don't know. Um, but that's another option. Uh, I will be back with some more Flame Keeper or Frozen Flame. Frozen Flame. There we go. Uh, so I'll be back with some more Frozen Flame after I get Linux reinstalled and get everything up and running again. Um, all right, guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time. This is Neo and I'll see you in game. Bye! <laughs> or something of that nature.